So as far as uh, any any soil or any potatoes inside of those clods, typically there is not anymore. There used to be prior to uh, applying something like the AgriThrive, but anymore where that soil will not adhere to them, we don't, we'll break those clods up to see if uh, there is potatoes uh, sticking inside of them and normally, no. We'll follow this truck to the uh, cellar and we can pick through 100 of them we want to just to see what is what is inside those uh, soil clods. Uh, typically uh, in the old days prior to AgriThrive we would have those potatoes inside those clods or a lot of dirt sticking to the potatoes just because this is a high very high clay content soil it is sticky and uh, anyway um, it's it's a definitely a benefit to the grower to not have this dirt going into storage or having to be washed off the potatoes going to Frito-Lay or to the fresh market uh, baking potato or wherever these spuds are destined for. The good thing is not a bunch of, uh, yeah, a lot of this was going in the truck. So as far as these uh, onions in the past, prior to using the AgriThrive, the, the skins would uh, have soil adhere to them as, as they did in the potatoes. I didn't notice it the first year, uh, but uh, all of a sudden year two, say, wait, something's different here. We're noticing a lot more root mass, which was an issue at harvest time, and a lot wider onions going into the truck. If you look, uh, uh, try to find those roots up there, you can see some of those plants Marco that uh, that still have a fair amount of roots attached to them. Well, that's unusual for an onion and or garlic crop. In the past, uh, we would never see this kind of root mass. Onions and garlic have terrible root systems, terrible root structure, which means lack of uh, water and nutrient accumulation. Ever since we've been able to go with the, the AgriThrive, we're seeing a lot more root mass, which the growers have commented on. Uh, that root mass, all we're doing is maybe giving you a chance for a better quality and yield. No promises, but extra roots is an extra chance. So I'm always about the, the, the root mass soil first, then we'll take what we can get on top.